Hi, maybe I'm Sarissa, maybe I'm not, but you can call me Rice because that is my nickname. Elegant Leisure Content Creator, Twitch Streamer, and welcome to my channel or welcome back. Today I'm going to talk to you about the Twitch new ad manager where they automate 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 you know what i'm saying make them roll automatically the ads it's new on twitch i'm just gonna jump and show you it's a short video i know what you do in a short video and possibly i know dreams do come true <laughs> um this is it it's in your creator dashboard and affiliate so if you're partnered i'm guessing and partner you go into ads when you go down below when you scroll down and there's the ad manager, you can activate it or deactivate it. It's optional, okay? It's optional. And it says it activates your schedule automatically on ads in your channel. You can put key pre-rolls too. I suggest not. This is the whole point is to eliminate the pre-rolls because Twitch did show and share on the um, creator camp. If you don't know about creator camp, I made a video. It's going to be in suggestive. Suggestive. It's going to be in suggested um, somewhere up there. And it's gonna and create a camp that showed us and talked about the pre rolls make people leave most of the time. So I do if you're doing this, recommend you disable it. So you can disable the pre rolls when you run the ads. And even if you deactivate this and you don't participate, pre rolls will still happen. So this is a way to not have pre rolls. So you can say, Okay, I'm doing the ads, so don't give me pre rolls from the beginning of your stream. And then you have to enable and to get this and also you have the enable the stream display ads which also is a new um tool that i talked about in a tiktok video and i think i also posted it on youtube but you click on ad manager and here they'll give you a step-by-step -step tutorial when it's the first time you're doing it i already done mine so you will not see the step-by-step -step tutorial but i promise you they give you a step-by-step -step tutorial this is very easy to find and they tell you your density like i have 2.7 minutes per hour but how I have a two minute ad every 45 minutes. That's how I have it. Oh, does it? Oh, that's pacing. Okay, I was saying the length of my ad is two minutes and it's every 45 minutes that it launches. And so on average, it's 2.7 minutes per hour. So I still have normally a spacing where I'll have a little bit of pre rolls, a little tiny bit because it shows up in my ad because I tried it out yesterday. Yesterday for me is not your yesterday because I do this video in advance. But it came up, it showed up in my dashboard yesterday. So I tried it immediately and I noticed that the ads were running because my chat told me and I wasn't I was playing and I know I was playing or painting, one of the two, and I know that it's like that's a still a pre-roll because the pre-roll thing countdown, if you know when you run your ads, was showing um zero zero. And when the ad runs, it runs like when you manually add add an ad, run an ad. So I really like this because I was someone who had a reminder on my channel to activate the ads. So I don't get pre-rolls because I don't like them on my channel personally. So I try to implement this. So let me know if you're interested in this. Let me know if you're going to use this device or your feelings towards ads on Twitch pre-rolls. You don't care. You do care what you think. And let me know everything. And have a great day. And subscribe, like, and comment. You know what every YouTuber say. Don't pretend you're new. Bye. <laughs>